This video describes the packaging process of umbilical cord blood and tissue for stem cell banking once the sample has been collected. How to pack the collection Number 1. Stick the blue client registration number sticker onto the blood bag. If you cannot find the blue blood bag sticker, please stick one of the patient's hospital stickers onto the blood bag. 2. Ensure the needle covers are securely placed, clamps are closed and two knots are tied in the tubing. This is very important to ensure the blood does not leak. Place the blood bag with the absorbent cloth between the white gel pack and then both the blood bag and gel pack into a clear bag and ensure it is properly sealed. This is very important to ensure that there are no leaks in the kit. The gel pack regulates the temperature of the umbilical cord blood and cord tissue and it is safe for the kit to remain at room temperature until the courier arrives. 3. Place the packaged blood bag into the foil bag and ensure that the checklist on the foil bag sticker has been completed. 4. If the cord tissue has been collected, the collection date and time must be recorded on the yellow sticker. 5. Place the cord tissue tube in the foil bag along with the packaged blood bag. 6. After the maternal blood test samples have been drawn, Place the four filled test tubes in the clear packet marked Maternal Blood Collection. 7. Date and time of collection must be recorded on the red sticker. 8. Place this packet in the silver foil bag. 9. Place the foil bag into the collection kit box. 10. Ensure all documents are filled in and signed. The documents must be placed in the collection kit box. It is imperative that the gynecologist or midwife has completed the birth ID form. 11. Please ensure that the box is placed inside the plastic courier bag and that the weigh-bill is kept on the outside to give to the courier. 12. The patient is then required to call the Nest Cells Client Services team on 084-664-4646 to arrange the kit collection. Please note, the cells remain viable for 72 hours and we endeavour to get them to our laboratory within 24 to 48 hours. The collection kit must always be kept with the patient and must not be left with staff or in the theatre.